guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I'll be reacting to Rune to episode 7 and 8 of season 2 of K-On! So let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. Oh, I shouldn't be sleepy, but I am kind of. So is this episode going to focus on her as a whole? It's not a picture of Mia? Yeah. See, originally I wasn't going to watch this until like later on tonight because I was <laughs> I kind of wasn't feeling good like two hours ago I had a um <laughs> my mom is suggesting me to drink these protein shakes slash meal replacement shakes so I was like okay I'll try it and it wasn't a big cup it was like a half a cup I, I drank the whole thing and I immediately just felt disgusted. Like, even though it's supposed to, like, make you full and such, I was like, oh, okay. I was like, but thinking in my head, why do I feel like I feel like I'm going to, like, gag and throw up? Like, it was good. Don't get me wrong. But I'm like, I want to ask you, but, like, there are some other flavors besides French vanilla. Can we add something in this? Like, <laughs> Because originally I was going to watch this like immediately after um, Mano got today, but I was like, uh, no, I don't feel good now. <laughs> it's like, I need to just like lay down. It is. Oh, there's a commercial for Pony Canyon. I actually didn't know that. I'm hoping, I'm, I'm probably guessing that uh, the next episode is going to be like that too. Well, I mean, that's because I downloaded it from GoGo. The other one of the other go go animes instead of kiss anime. Um, but someone is walking towards you. Oh. <laughs> Um, pig. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Excuse me. I, I know, yeah. But how can... <laughs> uh, I mean, you technically answered my question. True. Mm -hmm. the, the door? <laughs> You have a, yeah. My God, yeah, how do you know that? You have a sticker in your hair.
there's a meal. That's what it's for. The heck? <laughs> Okay. How is being like somebody lied to me? Hello, Cody. Jesus. <laughs> Japanese characters. Excuse me. No. Oh, shit. Of course. Oh. 
That's so sweet. She got her own private concert. <laughs> Are you okay? <laughs> of course. I don't know if that's cheesecake, but it looked like cheesecake, and I want some. <laughs> Excuse me. Now, now, how about just do the tea party and do a performance? That's it. Maybe a Q&A after, but it, it doesn't need to be like a bazillion things. Of course, Moogie would be the one to bring the giant cake. Okay. picture of her. Why did you use that? Oh my god, Mio chocolate. <laughs> Your fan club. So, do you want to change it then on a different day? She's still a fan of Mio, but she just can't do certain things. Because, you know, you can multitask, but because of the fact is that sometimes usually one thing is a bit bigger than another. You never know. It makes me hopeful that, like, when these girls do graduate, because I don't think it is going to happen, they don't drift apart. They still stay together and still keep that friendship and bond. Tighten it. <laughs> of course.
Oh, I thought she was going to wear like a special outfit. Mm. I know. Mmm. Take your time. Uh -uh. Holy crap, Moogie. <laughs> uh -huh. Honey. Oh my god! I I, I know cuz obviously I'm <laughs> Oh, oh, God. I liked it. It, it was interesting. <laughs>
了。Yeah, I think she would have loved it. At least before they graduate. Honestly, that was cute as fuck. I mean, you know, for Mio to have... I mean, but no, 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 hold on. Before I even say the fact that, yes, Mio has a found base, and it's very interesting, it, you know, it, it's mostly because of the fact that they're a band, and, I mean, they don't really always necessarily kind of look at the band. They just look at her as a whole. It's kind of what it reminds me of. Um, you know the group, uh, No Doubt, when they always really just cared about the main singer and they didn't care about the rest of the band? I'm not saying that, you know, her fan club doesn't care about the rest of the girls, but in a way, because they love Mio so much, it's just like, hmm, Mio only matters. <laughs> but it's cute, though. I mean, it, it, you know, it's really adorable and you never know. There might just be a fan club for all of them and not just one girl, but it was sweet. And I love the fact that, you know, all these girls came together and then learning the story of this fan club and how it technically started. I mean, I I've heard a lot of weird things about fandoms of certain people, uh, of TV shows, movies, whatever. But I think this, you know, this, like, <laughs> trumps everything. <laughs> I mean, as someone who's a part of like several fandoms and who freaks out <laughs> at seeing like a picture of your best boy, best girl, favorite actor, actress, learning about a TV show in history. <laughs> I understand how that feels. So. The future. See, I feel like with Yui, like maybe what she possibly wants to do for the future. I mean, she still probably maybe wants to still be a guitarist. So maybe she could be like a teacher for music, possibly, and teach kids how to play the guitar. It's going to be something with that. I mean, with like... Moogie, I, I don't know what Moogie might want to do. Um, Mio may want to continue, like, being a bass player. But then she might find something in college that really is going to sue her. Because Mio, I mean, she is the leader bass, like, type person in the group. So, I mean, hell, if it was my thing, I could see her as, like, an ambassador or someone really high up. Uh, Ritsu, I, I, I literally don't know. That's something... That's a whole story in itself that I would love for them to do an episode on, but I think just because of the fact that they're going to focus more on Yui with this episode, and then maybe they'll ask me to be like, you know, hey, what you want to do? And then she's going to be like, I have no idea either. And be like, okay. And be like, alright, both of y'all. What Do y'all know anything y'all feel like y'all want to do? What you want to be when you technically grow up? What, what you want to go to school for? You want to go for um, nursing, English, science, um, filmmaking, I don't think y'all are really good at filming, I don't know. Um, music, I, I, you know, for Reach On, I can see her doing something with music, but, like, for you, we still, I have no freaking clue. And the same thing for Moogie. But it was a really nice episode. Really, really heartwarming. And I'm really glad that, um, the former president <laughs> of her fan club got to see the picture of the, <laughs> the Mio fan club. <laughs> 
<laughs> all together with Mio. I mean, that's so freaking cute. Like, oh my god. Like, you know, you just hope one day that you can be that famous if somebody has, like, a fan club of you and you're just like, well, damn. <laughs> like, you know you really, really ultimately made it when there is a fan club of you and people support all the good and bad decisions that you do. Some people may not always like like the bad decisions that you do, but they'll always be there and be like, you know, I didn't like when you did this, but I still support you no matter what. I love you like a sister and everything or a brother and stuff. But yeah. All right. So go ahead and pause the video. I will see you guys in like one second for episode eight. Bye for now. Okie dokie. Episode 8, starting in 3, 2, 1, go. And I'm guessing I'm going to get that Ponyo, um, no, Pony Canyon uh, commercial. Oh! God, she looks so cute as a baby. Oh, damn. <laughs> oh, God, poor baby. Mm -mm. Well, why didn't you ask? Oh my god! Um, for baby. They're getting closer and closer to leaving Azania and my baby. Oh my god! I don't want to. <laughs> Mm. That ice cream looks so good. And I want some, but no. Mm. I kind of want some. Oh, wait, no, I got graham crackers. Let me eat some graham crackers out of this. <laughs> Have something sweet. No commercial this time. Nothing. No. No. Uh. So wait, how there's an all girls college? 
Really? Ah. But what if you want to go to America? Mm -hmm. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Do you at least have, like... No, Yui! Yui, wait! No, just hearing you two talk makes me excited. <laughs> Okay, so just a regular meeting. <laughs> like, hey, you want to be friends? <laughs> oh my god, so adorable. Of course you hungry. Are you gonna Yui? Yui? Yui Mm, interesting. What is she young? Oh. Mm. 
But it's still good, right? <laughs> but you gotta love her, though. She's an orbs. <laughs> and she's just a cute, adorable airhead. She's like Toru! Oh my god! Uh. Uh. It makes you wonder if that boy, that man, is successful. Oh my god, why did you say that? Of course. Like, what are you, like, doing, hun? No! I, yeah. No, I know what you can see Moogie doing. Moogie likes to bake. I mean, she loves making cakes and stuff, so I can see her being, like, a cake, uh, a, a baker. Having her own, um, pastry store? Bakery store? How about not? <laughs> huh. Well, Mio is still kind of really quiet as well, but that's okay. Really? Mm. Well, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my gosh, I got scared. 
Yes, you can. No, 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 no. Oh, she's so cute with her hair all the way down. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> oh. And then go from there. Mm -hmm. Oh my God, Jesus. You have to know things about flowers. Mm. Oh, Jesus. Yes. Oh. Oh, yeah. Yeah. That's more moogie than that, too.
Yeah, I knew they were going to say that. I know. Maybe she should work at the zoo or the aquarium. Mm -hmm. We only have two minutes left. Mm -hmm. Of course. I think she's trying. That's a good thing. But it's got something to do with that dang turtle because they're literally showing it a lot. But mm. so I'm guessing this is going to be a two parter episode and we won't get the answer until next week. I mean, I, I love the fact that both <clears throat> Weechan and Moogie, Yui, both put musicians and they both got rejected for it. I mean, because, like, look at today's day and age. Most kids want to be successful YouTubers, and especially, like, there are parents who think that YouTube is a job, and then there are other ones who honestly don't. And I mean, like, with me, I can pay my taxes with it, but it's really about dividing your money and saving your money. So I remember, I think it was, like, a couple of months ago, where um, there was a school somewhere that said, come dressed as something that you want to do and they said what's not acceptable is being a youtuber or a social media influencer because they said something about how it's not honestly a job so if you did anything whether it's youtube um you're an instagram model and such of course they're not really going to consider it and honestly they made a lot of little kids cry for it. I mean, but that's typically the day and age. Like I said, you, you have parents and men and women who automatically don't think about our generation, including, well, mine and younger. It's like, oh, okay, no, that's not really a job. Like, yeah, you can get paid for it, but... Mm. Aww. Oh. <laughs> uh, finals. Thank you. Uh, when you were a senior, and yeah, well, no, not even a senior. And it just really didn't even depend on what grade you're in. Finals was the worst thing. 
of our high school career. I hated finals. But then I kind of loved finals at the same time. I mean, mm. But it's just all that stress and you're just like, oh my god, you have like so many ish. And the biggest thing I would hate is that that whole week you had nothing but finals. Some of my classes had finals like a week or two weeks in advance. So then like the rest of the weeks we would just do other things. So I'd have to study like nonstop. But yeah, I mean, I'm hoping that you will find something that is her niche and that she's like, I really want to do this because... Honestly, out of and the same thing with Reach on because out of the four, two already know what they're going to do for technically their careers and where they're gonna go on to, while you have the other two girls in the group who are really kind of stuck and they're just like, oh, okay, we'll just pass by with whatever. Whatever comes our way, we will um go through it like head straight on and be positive and nothing bad's gonna happen but it's like it's the thing because you know when you graduate high school and you go on to college or you don't do college and you're dealing with the pros and cons of either going to school or not going to school it's just the things that you're gonna have to deal with even someone as myself like you're you're thinking of should I go should I not go should I do this like what do you want to do for the rest of your life and I really like the fact that they did an episode about this because not many animes especially even now do ish like that i mean we've had an anime that was about college and that was um grand blue which is one of my personal favorite animes that i watched on my previous channel and i i kind of want to see more where they're like okay we're transitioning from you graduated high school we're now on to summer and we move into college and we start our years our four years of college and then eventually maybe if someone goes into med school or something else. I mean, that would be honestly, like, really good. That would be a really nice anime. Do it, please. Oh my god, I would love to watch it. I think it'd be really interesting. And maybe something that for kids who, especially high schoolers, who just recently graduated and they're now going on into college and they can uh, relate to something. I mean, in anime in general, we all relate to something. And yeah, even at age 25 going on to 26 in October, there's a lot of things that I can relate to in an anime. You'll be like, uh-huh, I can't believe that. Because like, there's some things like, oh, I did that in high school, or I did this, or I recently kind of did that. But yeah, it was a really nice, sweet, calming episode. But because of the finals coming up, I, I feel bad for Sawa and everyone else. But yeah, no tea time. Only finals but other than that guys that is my reaction to you towards episode seven and eight of season two of k-on if you guys enjoyed it please give me a like it really helps me out also subscribe to my channel i make videos every single day join the master squad and of course i will see you guys officially all next wednesday for episodes nine and ten bye guys